Uh, at the bottom there, we have fresh chopped ahi tuna. In the middle, that's a house-made guacamole, and on top is a roasted corn pineapple salsa. Okay, Michael, how do you think of the ahi tuna? Well, I'm eating it so fast, it's disappearing really quick off my plate. I think I want five more. The presentation the presentation is really, really eye-catching. It's interesting. Uh, the flavor is, is spot on. So these are the crab cakes. Oh, I got, I got There's a little bit of house ramen on the bottom. That's our crab cakes. Um, nearly all crab, about 90% crab, and the rest a little bit of panko and some other filler. Um, on top there, we have a pineapple pico. I love crab cakes. I have to say, this is one of the best crab cakes I've ever had. I love the sauce on the bottom. Very good. So this is a braised pork shank. Uh, it's our pork asabuco. It's served over a home-style mashed potatoes, some root veg on there, your carrots, celery, and onion. And it's drizzled with the natural olive Awesome. Uh -huh. Fabulous. Absolutely fabulous. This is the asabuco. And it's excellent. I've tasted it, yes. The sauce it has a, a nice variety of different back flavors to it. You see they have some roasted garlic in here as well, along with the uh, bouquetier of vegetables. Um, this is a local, this is our group ricotta. It's a local fresh black grouper. And it's going to be lightly dusted in rice flour and pan seared. I must say, this is the best grouper I've had in quite some time. So look at it. Look how thick it is and juicy and inside. Look how white and flaky it is. Good stuff. Um, this one in particular is a black pudding with chocolate chip blueberries, and that's a salted caramel glaze over the top, and then a house made with cream. Blueberries, chocolate, everything you want's right there. Well, almost everything. <laughs> it was the perfect ending to a perfect meal.